What's up YouTube, my name's Adam, this is PC Build and welcome to the channel. Today I'm bringing you guys my favourite gaming keyboard. This is a SteelSeries Apex 7 TKL. Let's get into it. I've been using the SteelSeries Apex 7 TKL for around one year now and it's served me very well. TKL stands for 10 keyless. That means this keyboard loses the right side number pad for a more compact form factor. This makes it a great option for people with little space available. The Apex 7 TKL measures in at 355mm wide, 210mm deep. You can reduce the size even further to only 355 by 140 millimeters by removing the included wrist rest. The wrist rest is padded with a thin durable layer of rubber that's held up well so far. It's magnetic and holds on firmly to the keyboard without any unwanted movements. Overall the rest is very hard but it has a soft touch texture that's quite comfortable. The keycaps have held up well and are in great condition. Other keyboards I've used in the past can sometimes wear down quickly, especially on the high touch areas. We have anti-ghosting included with 84 key rollover. We have individual key customization with the SteelSeries app. You also have a choice of red, blue or brown switches when making the purchase. I went with blue switches because I prefer the clicky keys during gameplay. I'll give you a little bit of a listen now to see what that sounds like. Some people are going to prefer a more silent keyboard and if you're planning on doing a lot of typing then I would suggest the red or brown switches for a better experience. The keyboard is built well and does not flex even under heavy use. The rear of the keyboard is a molded plastic. The keyboard can be used on an angle or you can lay the keyboard flat. The front face of the keyboard is made of an aluminium alloy. Along with the responsive mechanical keys this gives it a very premium feel. The keyboard requires the use of two USB ports as one is needed for the USB pass-through. The built-in OLED display can be customised with the use of the SteelSeries Engine 3 app. Not only will you be able to design your own logos etc, there is a few pretty useful ones you can download such as the system monitor. You get direct media play pause and volume controls by using the scroll wheel and the button you see here, as well as control over some basic settings including illumination brightness, preset color patterns, custom macros, and your saved user profiles. That about wraps this video up. This is a highly recommended keyboard. If you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments, and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.